How'd you feel after that one? I felt fast. The only issue with this bar, oh, there's no traction in the middle. So it slips on your back a lot. I had two more sets, so I can't take a break. What's up? What's that, sir? Okay. Let's go, man. Oh. I do broken sets all the time. Yeah. It had like I had those six. I had a program of seven. I did six. Six was all I could do. I waited 15, 20 seconds, and I did the seventh one. Like it's cool. Just get you know, get it when you can. Everything's up here, man. You have to basically feel like an anime character whenever you get ready to start hitting those big lifts. I mean. Y'all call me Jiraiya, but like, I mean, yeah, I feel like a superhero whenever I'm at a meet, I'm feeling my best, and you know, I can tell in my warm-ups that it's gonna have, I'm gonna have a good outcome. And I've already set the tone mentally. So that's, these last two reps have that same approach. Make yourself your own superhero, and yeah, success is what you want out of it. This may be your plateau that makes you into the elite lifter, I don't know. It's good that we're tackling it earlier, you know? Better now than yeah to me whenever you're going for X Y Z number and you get a mental block because you feel like you can't hit it when it's just things that external factors that contribute to you hitting a plateau. This kind of thing. I definitely felt the mental block. Yeah, I definitely yeah. felt that. I was like, I wasn't think, like I wasn't picturing like I used to. I like, just picturing the lift. Mm -hmm. It was more like oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Yeah. 
in the best anime, they get it, the the fights get tough, and the good guy always gets his ass kicked halfway through it. You know, there's that next level that you have to find internally. It's in all of us, every single one of us. You will, you'll find it slowly. Tonight's a good night to start. It's always you versus the weaker version of you every single time you touch the floor. Which one wins? really tough days like these like I think to myself why the fuck am I here why the fuck am I putting myself to torture 435 for two sets of six after what 425 for one set of six then drop down to 315 for pause I've been on this journey with my coach for three months or month three right now I'll fucking do 435 what next? 500? 600? I feel like dying right now. <laughs> but, shit, it's exhilarating. <laughs> Everything about it the pain, the taxation on my body, the exhaustion, the frustration, the anger. And then when you do it, like finishing it and getting where you need to be, the excitement, the zenith of like happiness for myself at that moment. I'm not even trying to do this to be better than other people. Yeah, you know, the goal is to be a champion, but when I look back and be like, fuck yeah, I did this shit. I was an athlete. I was a lifter, I was a powerlifter. I competed nationally. I competed with the top 10% of the world. I was like, fuck. Wouldn't that be a fucking story to tell myself in the future, looking back? <laughs> <laughs>